Dear students, welcome back. This is Lazarski Talks, and this is Monday, 6 p.m., so here we are. Today, we have a happy birthday of our Lazarski Talks because we have the 10th episode. We weren't here in a month, so we've missed you. And today, we have a present for you. Instead of having one guest, we're having two guests. Very cool guys that look similar, because <laughs> they kind of are. And today, we're going to be talking about the very, very special faculty that we have at Lazarski University. And here we go. Let me start with the technical stuff that I say all the time. First of all, we are corona-free, and we're not lying about that. Second of all, turn off your microphones, please. And if you have any question you need, you can uh, text us in the Instagram or Microsoft Teams. Well, we know that you like to text more than speak to us, so please do that. And what else should I say? Thank you very much for co-hosting me today, my wonderful friend. <laughs> and uh, yes, happy. the word is yours. And I would like to remind you of one pleasant thing as the contest uh, for the coolest question which you guys are going to choose today from our students. So please remember about that and let's switch to the introduction. Today we have Pearson and Colton Pichinski. Yes. 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 <laughs> Can you guys shortly introduce yourselves? Hi, I'm uh, Colton. This is Pearson. Uh, Pearson. Uh, we're both uh, <laughs> from the United States and yeah. we're studying the... We're brothers. Yeah, brother, <laughs> yeah, brothers. And we're studying the aviation law and professional pilot's license program here at Lazarski. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And I'm just wondering, if you finish Lazarski University, this faculty, and you're going to Germany mm -hmm. or to, to Germany, uh, to Germany or to France, yeah. Yeah. do you need to know their law or how? what is the reality of this? No, as, as a pilot, not necessarily. It's good to know and it's required in, you have to take, in order to get like your ATPL license, which is like the big license to get. It's like airline commercial. transportation license. Yeah. Is like the, you have to, yeah. you have to take 14 tests and one of the 14 tests is air law. It's just generic law, mm -hmm. but you wouldn't have to specifically know the law of Germany or France, mm -hmm. but you should just know the general principles of like, I can land, I can legally land here. Or I can take off here, but not necessarily. It's, it's pretty generic and you can go pretty much anywhere. And that's a anywhere. big, like, yeah, very, yeah. like yeah. The, the Polish law is helping us for like here, but like, no, uh, for instance, like if we wanted to fly for like to France, then we wouldn't have to like study the, like the French, French law, law yeah. and then like oh we have which is nice <laughs> which is very <laughs> yeah. nice yeah yeah, yeah. Makes things easy um, by the way yeah. do you need to speak Polish in order to um, no. do what no. you do thankfully no <laughs> no I think it, that's very important point oh, yeah. to, sure, to make sure. Sure. most everything yeah. in, in aviation tends to be in English mm -hmm. uh, especially air traffic control procedures things inside the airplane it's in English it would help obviously if you're uh, if the, your co-pilot or your captain was mm -hmm. Polish it would just for just conversation but not necessarily yeah no, you could yeah, the whole, English, yeah. whole program is in English even yeah. our flight training and all that's in yeah, English which um, is good for us oh it's yeah, so yeah, yeah we're learning yeah. Polish but yeah. it's we're struggling yeah it's a little hard <laughs> yeah. yeah okay so can you just tell us finally and we're going to go to the next question what is the favorite class that you have I mean it's not necessary that you have the same uh, favorite yeah, class yeah so. that's hard oh goodness um, yeah. meteorology is cool what? it's hard meteorology mm -hmm. It's like it's like the study of weather. weather. Yeah, yeah. Like weather. It's weather. <laughs> Which the, the weather. Well, the only reason it's hard though, <laughs> it's hard. But like the reason I like it is because it makes me feel smart. <laughs> oh yeah, you feel smart because it's like it's like yeah. cloud types and things. So that like, you can look outside and you're like cloud course. types. Cloud types. Yeah, because yeah, like different you types have of types clouds. Of clouds. People. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You so have it's like if you types. Didn't know. Of yeah, 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 yeah. But it's like because you're like, oh, of course, when it's just raining in this cloud type, it's <clears throat> there's a front moving in. And you're yeah. like, you know, but like you know, it makes yeah, you feel, you like, feel like, yeah. a, like a weather man. Like, yeah. oh yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like yeah, yeah, I'm predicting the weather. But I'd say meteorology. I like you it. say meteorology. Yeah. What do you say? Probably like we take general knowledge about the aircraft, which is essentially. It sounds. It's like <laughs> what you're like laughing. Basic, okay. Yeah, no. It's like it's all like the aircraft system. So it's like I would say it's all more mechanical. Where it's like uh, how the engine works for different like turboprop and like yeah. stuff like that. I'd say that's why. Because like when we go to the airport, you can see like you can see like an engine. You're like, oh, I know how that works. Like a lubricating system for oil. You're like, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Most of the time. Sometimes most it's time. like most of the time you're like right. until they point out something and you're like, oh, that's yeah, like yeah. <laughs> but probably general knowledge about the yeah. aircraft. Yeah. But there's about a, a bunch of good classes though. Oh, I mean, they're all enjoyed, really interesting. We've yeah. enjoyed most of it. I mean, there hasn't been a class that we've like disliked. They've always been, they're, they're all good. Meteorology is just my favorite, but that's just, yeah. 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 That's cool. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I see that we have a question from the student. Yeah. And uh, you can read it. Okay. Um, coming back to this law stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there is a question. How different are international and national laws? Is it easier to learn one knowing the other? Yes. Actually, I would say that because of the fact that most in, in aviation there's like conventions and things oh yeah yeah there's conventions <laughs> and, and, and things so 
most national uh, laws um, that countries have accepted are based on principles and documents and treaties of international law. Mm-hmm. It's, there's a convention that came out in 1944. It's called the Chicago Convention. And most countries signed that convention. They went to um, – and they signed the, the document. So most laws are based off of that Chicago Convention. So understanding international law really, really helps with understanding national aviation law just because it's 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 almost the same thing. There's very, very small differences. Yeah, I would say like yeah. the, the national aviation law is – it goes more it's into detail. Yeah, yeah, it goes more into detail of like like Polish airspaces, for instance, yeah. where obviously, where obviously the international law yeah. wouldn't cover that. It's more of like a- airspaces in Europe, yeah. for instance. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I would say yeah. they're they're but both. I mean, I shouldn't say they're easy. Like, there's some complicated stuff to it. But once you like work through like the documents and stuff, it's it's really yeah. not that yeah. difficult. It's but interesting. Yeah, yeah they, they work together. And I would say they work really well yeah, together. If you understand one, you'll understand the other. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice. It makes it easy. <laughs> oh, for sure. Yeah. They're saying it's so easy, but yes. for me, it's so complicated. <laughs> you have types of cloud just for him. <laughs> <Yeah, types laughs> I still have this, yeah. this phrase. Oh, I'm yes, there. Yes. I'm there in yeah. that, that moment of our conversation. So, uh, we are moving to another one. I know that while enrolling and on the very first stages of this program, you have psychological tasks, right? Yes. Yes. That, that falls yeah. in within like the, the, medical check. the medical check. Okay. Can you tell about this? <sighs> yeah. How, how do they check you? Every, they check everything yeah. and so obviously if you're in an airplane then you need to be like fit to fly and you know like tip top shape how do they say it um and so we were required to get like how would you say it like a yeah it's like a full it's like a full analysis of everything they so, check everything so like we had to get our blood drawn and you have to do this every single year yeah. um and uh, it gets dicey whenever you're like i think it's over the age of this is air law coming in uh, i think yeah. it's like over the age of like 40 yeah is it's like twice, twice a year, a year. I I anyway 60 three or four times a yeah. year so we have a lecture here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah sorry, sorry. sorry. I didn't yeah. make this like more. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, okay, so essentially you get like a, a medical check, and yeah. it's basically to blood work. It's blood work, uh, vision, hearing, uh, X-rays. X-rays. Uh, uh, they also do hearing, uh, sight. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, you did. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, and then the psychological side of things, oh, okay. which yeah. that was less of what I thought it would be. It was more about can you do tasks of, like they'll have like two little like almost like joystick things. Mm-hmm. And they would have on a screen, it would be like objects and you had to move objects in like a line, but it was just, can you multitask by doing two yeah. things at once? Because obviously in, in an aviation scenario, you're going There's to multiple be, things yeah, going things are going to be going on. And so can you yeah, kind of multitask? But yeah, but yeah, it, it was good. It's, it was definitely interesting. I hate needles. Uh, and oh yeah. Work, so I almost yeah. passed out, but that was. Needles don't bother me, but he was, he was freaking needles. out. Yeah, but I hate needles. We passed. <laughs> thanks for Yeah. 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 And, um, yeah. But yeah, and the initial check, it's like super intense. Like it's like it took us four every, to five yeah. hours yeah. to do, and it's it's kind of funny. It's like a scavenger hunt. It's like oh, go to this doctor, go to yeah. that doctor, yeah. and so it's obviously it's not fun because you're being like checked there's by needles involved. there's needles involved. Yeah. Um, yeah, but I know like next year they it's I mean they still like check you, but it's much less intense. Less intensive. Um, yeah. It was just to prove that basically like on the you're higher good. standard yeah, you're like I'm, I'm good and it's nice because Medicare, there's yeah. not to keep talking about it but there's like <laughs> there's different medical checks like there's a, like a general aviation medical check which is like if you only want to fly like small planes but we had to get the commercial level uh, as if like we're flying like obviously we're going to be flying large amounts of people so we had yeah. to get like the which is funny because te- medically we were rated to fly the biggest airplane that there is yeah. out there so we have like but a, like, like yeah, a commercial like, medical okay, check allow but, me. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask the question straight away. I didn't okay. have it on the list, but I just you know came <laughs> just came up. Uh, when you're at the airport mm-hmm. and you have to fly somewhere, mm-hmm. do you s- already see the things another way yeah. from other yes. people? Yes, yes. And yes. What it are the things we, that you find yeah, out? Yeah, we know it's because yeah. Okay, obviously getting a pilot's license we knew was hard. But then you start looking at like what it takes to become a captain of like an airline and you see the steps that are involved to get there. It's like before you're like, oh, that's, that's the captain. That's really cool. But now I'm like, oh my God, this guy's like, gone you're like, through like, like, like that's, that's respect. Yeah. I was like, this guy's gone through yeah. so much. Yeah. But even, even just understanding like stuff that you see at the airport with like, uh, especially ground, things that are moving on the ground. It's nice when you understand it because we, as some of our classes deal with just stuff at the airport, just understanding what's going on. Even though it doesn't pertain to us, we'll, we won't be on the ground, we'll be in the plane. But it's nice just to know what's what's moving around so you're like i know the name of that object i know this and that you feel yeah. much yeah. like you were saying you yeah, feel yeah, much yeah. cooler i know the name of t- type of clothes type of yeah, clouds. yeah, <laughs> type of yeah clouds, you can look exactly. at the window and you're like oh that's yeah. turbulent like oh, don't yeah, want to fly yeah, there oh, yeah, yeah. yeah um but no you definitely understand more yeah. things about an airport but especially it's, but it's super it's uh, it's very satisfying too because oh yeah it's like you know that you're learning and you know that like yeah it just feels good it's just nice yeah can we go please to the question number three uh because i think it's uh you know 
this kind of question yeah, I because that. I really sorry. think that uh, you know students need to know about that because yeah. uh, in order to know the types of clouds and uh, uh, yes, to respect the pilot, yeah. <laughs> yeah. we have one very serious question that I'm asking you to ask. Uh, I'll put it that way. Yeah. Can you explain step by step how you can be enrolled to the this aviation program in Lazarsky University? Yeah. So I think the first step that we did, well, we, we found it, <laughs> we, <laughs> it was, a good, was, a, was yeah. a good step. But then we, we emailed, there's a coordinator, um, Vlad. Vlad, um, and who so helps we, out a lot. Yeah, and so he, yeah, he helped us. And so we just emailed him and just said, you know, we were interested in, in the program. What would what steps would we take? And all it was was just, I mean, it was just pretty generic. It was a really quick like process because we actually found the program relatively late. Like classes have already like already started, yeah. and so we were scared because we're like, oh no, we missed it. Um, we had like a week to apply yeah. before the deadline, and um, it was it was fairly easy. We took uh, we had to take two tests. It's it was a math and a science. Test. A math, yeah, um, we passed them. <laughs> um, wow. You sit right. here. Yeah, no, exactly. Yeah, we're, we're <laughs> constantly <laughs> passing. Yeah. Um, okay. And then uh, the medical check is one of the things you will need um, basically to prove that, like, you don't want to be taking flight lessons if you don't, yeah. if you can't fly medically. And so that was one of the things we had to get. But um, generically, it's pretty much just like kind of like a resume that, mm -hmm. do, that you just take the two placement tests and then the. And then yeah, they just ask you just for more documents, like visas, things like that, if you're interested. We did have students. to, which was funny for us, but it makes sense. We had to have a oh, Skype English interview yeah. proving we spoke English. So obviously yeah. for us, it, it was yeah, actually it was funny. funny. It was a funny yeah. conversation. You were checking if the people who were yeah. checking you speak English <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. properly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was funny, but it was just, just to check to make sure that obviously, because going in, the, the whole program's in English. So it just needed to make sure that obviously you're going to understand things of going through, which was which is good. So we had to take it, which was funny. It was but a good interview. It was yeah. good. It's, it's a good step. It was a good five minutes. It, but yeah. Probably you were just speaking so fast that people who were interviewing I know, didn't yeah. understand anything. Yeah. Yeah. They're like, okay, we yeah, 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 just, just let these people yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. Push them along. Yeah. 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 Uh, we have another question from, uh, from, uh, not from the guest, Jesus, from the student. <laughs> and uh, quite interesting one, by yeah. the way. Okay. What airlines are you most attractive to work in for you? Interesting. That's actually a hard question. Because we have this debate almost every single day. We've actually been talking about this. Almost every single day. Because obviously, like most people, if you build time with an airline, uh, just to cut to it, you get paid the most because you have it's like yeah, a it's like a loyalty uh, bonus almost. And so, we don't know. Uh, in Europe, I can I can narrow it down. We want to fly in Europe because obviously we're getting a European license. Um, ooh. I'd say Lot Polish Airlines. Lot Polish Airlines we're, we're is, here. is I here. I, I mean, it's a it's a great airline, and I mean, we have a flight mentor who he he's a seven eighty seven captain for Lot Polish mm -hmm. Airlines. So it's nice because we're already starting to kind of understand how Lot works, as especially mm -hmm. from the role of a captain. Obviously, we're not at the captain level yet, but <laughs> hopefully, we'll get yeah. there one day. But it's just nice because we have like inside information on mm -hmm. how that stuff works, and so I think it would be a great stepping stone, especially coming here or living here in Poland. Um, especially, we're trying to learn Polish, and so once we as we get closer and closer, we could make it, I don't know, up a lot Polish Airlines, yeah. yeah. Can we please move that question about Poland up to the... Yeah, <laughs> we, we can do that, but really just, just one that. tiny yeah. question. Okay. Do you have some airlines that you simply don't respect or don't like when it comes to Europe? When it comes to Europe? When it comes to... Oh, <laughs> no, <laughs> we I mentioned the bad landing... Uh, if oh, France, uh, for example, they lose the baggage every yeah, single well, time, no, I, I feel like no, because no, I think I, I think the most reputations of airlines. A lot of times, especially with, when it comes to smaller airlines, it usually like with hard landings and things like that. Like, but it's like it's just yeah. because it's new pilots, and, and that's something that I think is just it's a good step. Yeah, because typically, if you're doing like no, domestic, no, yeah, if you're doing like domestic airlines. flights, you're like a you're the new guy. The new right? guy. Yeah. yeah, so it's like I don't. There's not an it's airline. Certainly, like the airlines fault. Like all airlines. Yeah, there's not like one that I'm like, oh no. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, oh Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Why Poland? Uh, yeah. Simple as that. Good, Please uh, explain. Yeah, question. Yeah. Yeah. One. So y one day you are looking for this uh, degrees in aviation law. J just again, you are in the United States of America yeah, at that yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. 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 in yeah. USA I you are at, looking for school, aviation yeah. degree yeah. Uh, law, yeah. all this yeah. stuff. And you see Poland, and you're like, "Yes, that that's is it. The country. That's the one. We are going." Yeah. Why? You explain. You're. You have. Yeah. I, story I, to I tell. came one year before he did. He was here last year. And yeah. so the it was. I want. I knew I wanted to go internationally outside the U.S., but I didn't know where. So I just started kind of doing some like country searching of just searching different things. And Poland came up, and I I really liked Poland. And so <laughs> I, and so then it was crazy because I I moved here, but I had never visited once. I just up and moved and so I, I came here and I went to another university for a year and then I found Lazarski and then uh, 
the rest is history. And, and then I was like following in the same footsteps. Uh, because actually, I had to do the hard work. You know, I graduated so. high school a year early because I was like, oh, I got to get to Poland. And so I graduated high school a year early, and then went to the same university he went to for a week. And then transferred here. Transferred here. So I yeah. was, yeah. I attended a week of classes, yeah. and then we found this university, and yeah. I was like, was, yeah, we, much better. So yeah, we love the the program much better. Here. Oh, so, so we're so much more. So enjoyable. immediately transferred. Yeah. Can I ask you a question? Uh, yeah. Your relatives or your classmates from your American school? Yeah. Did they ask you a question about uh, you know moving to this country? Yeah, it was kind of a, a lot of questions. Yeah, yeah uh, it, it was just weird, especially because within the United States, a lot of people just go to college either locally almost mm -hmm. if you would just stay where you're at, and so for us to kind of just uh, we're just not, 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 we're not going not out only of state, leaving we're going the state. out of the states, you know, like yeah. we're leaving. Yeah, but at the same time, I was like, for us, it was just we wanted to see the world. So, And people are skeptical, but then we're like, like just let us let us, let us do, do our thing. We're like, it'll yeah. work out. It'll do work you out. like it here? Oh, yeah, yeah we, we love, love it. it here. Yeah, yeah actually, it's, it's like even with like COVID, I, I've talked to people and they're like, oh, like, are you like regret moving there because of like COVID's going on? I'm like, no, oh, it, yeah, we're still having a good time. I mean, yeah, it like limits some things, but it's. It's still fun. We love it. Yeah, it's it's fun. Cool. Yeah. yeah. And like, it's you meet so many cool people. Yeah, that's the for thing. instance, I've like met so many awesome people. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. In Lozarski or outside the university? Both, both. <laughs> yeah, just by running people on the street or just talking to someone. Yeah. Uh, and actually, on the I, ha street. I have yeah. to mention <laughs> that you know Lozarski Student Help Desk. You organize a lot of events, and I think you are yes everywhere. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> and yeah. it's actually that's we usually we attend. Yeah. I think most. I think of all of the people. Actually, all the people we've met through Lozarski is actually yeah, at the yeah. yeah. So it's like it's thank a great. You. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Yeah. Appreciate that. We actually have one more question that is related to what we're talking. What we talk about here, so. How do you pronounce your surname? Ah, see, this is this is this is a fun one. This is yeah. Uh, so, in the United States, it's pronounced Pazinski, but that's that's not correct in, in terms wrong. of the Polish. <laughs> yeah, it's wrong in yeah. terms of how it's supposed to be pronounced yeah. in Polish. We're missing a letter. It's it's a Y, um, yeah. so it should be Piaczynski with the Y, but it's. It's spelled incorrectly, so it's yeah. because we have a question: Is uh, is it weird to hear your surnames pronounced differently here? Uh, or you're like, okay, call me whatever. We you got like. used to yeah. it, and it's actually kind of cool because they like say it in like the proper way, and we're yeah, not so used to that because like yeah, I feel even more sophisticated. In, yeah, even in the United States, states like our teachers, they couldn't pronounce, they pronounce their last it. name. They yeah. like they butcher it. Yeah. I don't know how they would say it, but yeah. um, so no, it's kind of cool. That it's like, oh yeah, that's like. Authentic, that's like authentic. Yeah, Piotrowski, yeah. 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 Um, and even uh, when you got a you got a credit card or yeah, like a debit I card got here, I, and I got my they bank spelled account. it wrong. Yeah, when I got my bank account the the first time, the on the card, I put my name in how I'm I, how I spell it without the Y. Yeah. But then the guy at the bank put the Y in there, thinking that I had just misspelled it. So they sent me the card, but I couldn't use it because it wouldn't match up yeah. to my passport. Yeah. So I had to go. I had to awkwardly go back to the bank and be like, like, no, I understand it looks completely wrong. Yeah, it looks wrong, <laughs> but, but I promise you, it's right. The Y. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So people uh, who finish economic faculty, economics faculty, or whatever, when you work in a bank, please just follow whatever <laughs> a person yeah, I is, is filling in <laughs> in the blank. Yeah. yeah. We also had this conversation with a director of the studio here yeah. while preparing the episode, and yeah. he's like, "Are you sure yeah. this yeah. is the That's correct it's, it's way to?" Write the surname. Uh, like, not yeah. to go back to the medical exam, but like the doctors, the exam, they yeah, would they write it with the Y, y and we yeah. felt bad because, like, yeah, that's how it's supposed to be, but yeah. like, but so it's we're like, feeling sorry for you. Yeah, yeah because but, like, but what's weird is I wish like we had a Y. In the United States, they spell it incorrectly because they just can't they can't spell it. But then people in Poland misspell it because it looks wrong to them. Yeah. So it's funny because it's like we can't win. Yeah, we're, yeah. <laughs> we're always losing. They will yeah. remember you forever. Uh, hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Should we read the question from the student? Yeah, I think so. Should I? Do? Okay. <laughs> you said about X-ray uh, when you were talking about this medical stuff, but is it? But it is harmful, and regular checks could harm person. How often those dangerous are those dangerous checks? I think it's just dangerous checks. I think for the X-ray, I think it's just once. Um, it's mm -hmm. just for the initial check. It's just to make sure that, that like, just bone-wise, that everything is okay, and there's not like any more. Bone. I think it's checking more of like, uh, like scoliosis and like, like he was yeah. saying, like to yeah. make sure yeah. you're it's like. Just more like, but you only do it once, I unless think, yeah. there was any reason that they need to check you again. Okay. But that would be, I think it's just once. Yeah. Uh, okay, we have we have this. Uh, can you read that? Because I don't really. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening there? Seriously, I, I hear so much new things. Uh, are you talking about this yes. one, the last one? Okay, uh, we have a question from Victoria. Did you use the ICAO alphabet for secret communication? Ah, 
So yes. you see, we're stupid here. Uh, I, yes. I, don't, I don't know what that's. I can't. I can't. Yeah. I can't, I can't so yeah. in our, we have an English for pilots class, yeah. and so in that class, we're we're not allowed to say our names. So yeah. So I'm Papa yeah. India. I'm because Kilo it's Oscar. P I Papa India. Yeah. Um, so and also the the professor wanted us to text each other, but we would have to spell out the words in that alphabet which yeah. was we haven't done it yet so yes can you explain what is the alphabet yeah okay so so what, what is the whole thing? Word, yeah. yeah so whenever there's like any call signs or anything like that and there's letters you have to like say them out in a different way so alpha bravo charlie delta uh echo, echo. foxtrot so it's like that yeah. so it's so that there's no miscommunication of saying a b c d e and it's just it's just a and it's mostly alphabet. because and we learn about it in the english for pilots class is a lot of we and we actually learn about it we'll watch like air traffic control like mess ups yeah. where like for instance someone says something and they don't completely understand yeah. it, they think they said something else and so the alphabet is to basically even numbers, even numbers like, like nine is niner uh five is fife and then four is like four. four. Yeah, it's hard. Three it's weird to say, but but it's the idea is that to make sure that there's no accidents from people yeah. mishearing things. You want to change extend the word, the word so yeah. there's more syllables. I have it. never ever heard about that. Really, yeah. it's too. like it's similar to like the military alphabet or yeah. like um so the like law in, enforcement. In Poland, any airplane that's registered in Poland is Sierra Papa SP. Like it starts yeah. with Sierra. In the United States, it's it's now we're going November. back to air law. Yeah, now we're now we're yeah. Papa India and you Kilo Oscar because they yeah, yeah she takes the first yeah. two letters and so um, our classmates are what Sierra, yeah. Sierra no, Zulu it, and, yeah uh, but it's funny because like the first class that we had to do that it was a little stressful <laughs> because oh, yeah. you're like Kilo Oscar and you're like you, it's not your name you're, so you're like, like you're where's not, Kilo Oscar yeah, you're yeah. not used to hearing yeah. it but now we've gotten to a now point it, at first it's, yeah it was it's stressful good. now it's like yeah I cool. yeah. never yeah. thought that you know being a yeah. law aviation aviation yeah. law student is yeah so much Papa fun. India yeah. Yeah. Papa I should India. get a tattoo just, like, <laughs> just Papa, have Papa India. India get tattooed yeah. on the arm yeah yeah maybe a little heart yeah would you go for the fifth question fifth one okay um well, do you think being a pilot is more than just a certain set of skill? Uh, what does the pilot do when he is in a bad mood? Breakdown, for example. Has I'm a just breakdown. really wondering. Cause, ooh, ooh. Okay, you're having a break. Uh, yeah. I don't know. You're breaking up with a girlfriend <laughs> or, or whoever. <laughs> time. Yeah. And you're like, okay, mm -hmm. I should yeah. go and fly this thing now. But I don't want to do that. I want to just, you know, cuddle uh, a pillow. Yeah. Oh, I just want to yeah. eat Nutella. Cry and watch cry. Netflix. Yeah, yeah no, exactly. I that cream, yeah. And drink. Yeah. And, yeah. <laughs> and drink. Ice yeah. cream. Just ice cream. Yeah. So, um, what do you do? Yeah, that's uh, that's actually that's another class that we have. <laughs> it's, it's a class uh, for it's everything. Like, yeah. It's human factors talking about. <laughs> we had that today before this. We, we actually, actually had, had it. It's yeah. human factors. So it's dealing with like the psychological and physical things, just attributes about of the pilot. human. Can you share some techniques? Well, like oh, like to, to dealing. Oh, with like things? what's a lot? Yeah, a lot of it is like stress management and things. But we haven't talked about. I don't think we've talked about psychological psychological effects. Mostly, no. We've only talked. We haven't got there yet. Yeah, but mostly. you have so cool classes when you're on your, uh, you know, studying. I mean, yeah. oh, they're, they're, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. They're all they're it's all really interesting. Yeah. and they get complicated. Like, like they today get. We talked about hypoxia, which is the, the basically the lack of oxygen. So when you get to a certain altitude, obviously the oxygen outside isn't enough for us to like to get enough oxygen to our brain. Mm -hmm. So we start saying and doing things that we normally wouldn't yeah um and so obviously as a pilot that's not good because you're you <laughs> know you're flying an airplane feet yeah, yeah. in the air so, and but it was we were talking about why that happens talking about this the medical side of things yeah. of like it's mostly a medical class yeah. honestly but um, it's also good because it gives us the effect like what what should what will happen if we're getting hypoxic and that meaning we're getting sick so it's like it was like short-term memory loss yeah. nausea things like that so if we start experiencing symptoms we as pilots can yeah. be like hang on something's but not to right. answer your question we haven't got there yet we haven't got there yet <laughs> we're, we're, but I, there are like yeah. uh i mean and there's a lot of things like aviation is it's all about like standardization where it's like yeah. uh where how would you word it like you can't you can mess up but there's always like a checklist or there's always like a, a way to a redu redundancy for instance yeah. and so like if you're like mad at something then obviously you're gonna have like a co-pilot or like another pilot hopefully. that would like check <laughs> you and it's so like if you're yeah. not paying it hopefully yeah. Okay. hopefully yeah if it's a safe environment yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah um so you'll always have someone like i guess watching over you and it's so like if you do something stupid then obviously they can report it and then you'll yeah, because like you want to be safe in the air, and so oh, yeah, of course, of course, yeah. yeah. But that's that's the thing, because you cannot just go yeah. to the airport one day and say, you know, guys, I'm taking the day off. And exactly. Yeah. No, yeah. Want to cuddle the pillow? Yeah. And, yeah. yeah. And that's the hard part is like, especially trying to make sure that there's an even kind of understanding between all pilots that like even on the worst day you keep a level head. This is it's like you're performing a task and keeping people safe. Because mm -hmm. at the end of the day, it's all about getting from point A to point B. Exactly. Safely. And so, safely, yeah. And so in that case, it should just be on you yeah. to make sure that like. You know, what, I think our student has um have. A question. Okay. 
uh, regarding your position at Lazarsky University. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So the first question is, have you been studying at university in Poland, uh, meaning your experience of how yes. much time? Uh, just one, I, I came last year, so one year, but then... This I'm new. Now I'm about to be one year at Lazarsky. So you yeah. came one year ago and yes. you were studying at... Polytechnic of Warszawska. Polytechnic of Warszawska. Yeah. At the faculty of... Aerospace Engineering. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and then I did one week of electrical engineering. <laughs> a a yeah. whole one week. One yeah. week. It was pretty, yeah. 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 And right. then yeah. you're here. So you both, yeah. because we have another question. Pearson on the left okay. is a first year student and Colton, yep. you, yeah. uh, is a second year. That's yep. not right. Or that is right. No, we're, no, both, we're, we're both first year. We're both yeah. first year. So you're, yeah. you're yeah. first year mm -hmm. students. So I we're brothers, and so yeah. it makes it a lot easier yeah. kind of riding off each other. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so um, there is no yeah. difference between your years. You're just first year yeah. students, yeah. and you're together. Mm -hmm. I just have more engineering yeah. experience. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. I have a um, week. <laughs> talking about this, uh, you know, whole situation in the um, on the plane. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you know that a lot of, well, you certainly <laughs> do, that a lot of people are afraid of height. Oh, yes. Yeah. Do you think that the experience that you're going to get and the love and the fact that you've chosen this faculty is because you want to experience these feelings? So what do you say? What would you say to a person who's, for me, if I'm coming to yeah. you and I'm saying, like, I'm not going to come with you to this plane because I'm not afraid of yeah. height and I'm yeah. just not going to take this. You actually, like, I mean, we, we're, like, I guess, thrill seekers. Like, we love, like, roller coasters and all that. Um, so, like, heights don't bother or yeah. doesn't bother yeah. us. Yeah. But honestly, like, I mean, it's easy for us to say because we, it doesn't bother us. But, like, when you're in, like, a plane, like, think about it. Like, if you're flying in, like, a, like a big plane, like, you don't really think about – I mean, obviously, you're way high in the air, but you don't think about it. And it's the same in, like, a, a small plane, like a general aviation plane. is like, yeah, you realize you're super high up, but you, you also realize how safe it is because, yeah. like, tra uh, flying is, like, one of the – I think it's the safest yeah. form of transportation. And I think that I think would, would like, especially help with someone who either had a fear of heights or even fear of flying – it's like it's the idea that like if you're the one in control of the actual, it like, makes you're it the one flying, you feel better. You feel yeah. a lot more like secure. It's kind of like driving. Like if you drive with someone who drives crazy, if you're the passenger, it's terrifying. Yeah. But if you're the one driving, then you're like, yeah, okay, it's I'm, like it's I'm, me. I'm I have the one it, yeah. driving. So I think the same thing with flying is yeah. like it's like if you let the person fly for just a little bit, I think they would get over it just because of the fact that like I'm in control, I understand what's going on. Yeah, and you realize it's yeah. really not that scary. Because like even, you know, we just flew this past weekend and we were yeah. like 1,800 feet. Yeah. And it. And we're just eighteen hundred. Yeah, I, 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 just yeah. Say, I say it's eighteen hundred. I say it's so we're casually. Doing, like, but, but it's like it's it that's, fine. that's extreme. I mean, not extremely high in yeah. compared, but like it's it's really high up there. But it's like yeah. you don't feel like you're no. That high yeah, like up we like, even yeah. hit we hit turbulence, and so we're like we're bouncing around. But it's like fun. So much fun. Yeah. We have so many questions from the students. I don't know what to do. So okay, can you, you <laughs> read this one? Uh, can I combine this one with ours? Yeah. Exactly. Mm, okay. The question from student. What's the most challenging thing for each one of you in this course? And I would add one thing. And what is the coolest thing Ooh. about this? I would say that the hardest thing for us to learn thus far has actually been, it's actually referring to more of the law side of things, is European Union law. That's just because... It's difficult for us because, yeah, because we're, we're not never, used to it. Because we're, we're like going through high school in the United States, all we learned was U.S. government. We never learned anything about... We knew what the European Union was, but not how it functioned or how it worked. So then we had to take college-level classes of the European Union. So it was, it was a learning curve, but I think that was hard just to get used to it. But now... We're in EU internal market law, and it's like, okay. Yeah, now, like, I now think we okay. know more about, like, European Union law than, than we, we do about the United States. So now yeah. it's, like, flipped, <laughs> yeah. um, which is interesting, and yeah. we love it. But I think it was uh, just the EU stuff at the beginning. but Yeah, but, y again, we, we had, yeah, like you were saying, the, like, introduction classes. So they really, our professors helped out so yeah. much for, like, because they understood, like, hey, this is new for you. And so um, it helped us out a lot. It helped us out a lot, yeah. yeah. And then the coolest thing, what would you say the... Are you satisfied? Just, just you know, yeah, yeah, while yeah. thinking, <laughs> yeah, yeah. are you satisfied with um, because we're in Poland, you're yeah. from America, yeah. Yeah. the language of your teachers, the material? Oh, absolutely. absolutely, yeah, yeah, there's yeah. Never been, we've never had an issue. No. Cool. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, and it's been, it's, it's fantastic. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's nice. And it's, it's there, there'll be like a word that they'll forget, and so it's we have like a job, like oh, yeah, you're, we'll, you're thinking we'll of this, yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll fill in the word. But so then they also help us with Polish. They'll help then, us with like, Polish. They'll say it in English. It's like word, Agatha. She know, was teaching yeah. us Polish. Yeah. 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 If you want to know what it is in Polish, and we're like, yeah, why not? Yeah. So then we learn it in Polish. So then we yeah. Kind of, yeah, it works. But no, there's never like a language problem. It's always okay. I just I just want to say we didn't pay these people. Yeah, 
yeah, yeah, we're, yeah. We're not paid this is like over the table, everything. like yeah. And I think yeah. you're doing a great, you know, promotion of your faculty yeah, here, yeah, and yeah. we're super satisfied because it's 100 yeah. of your honesty and of oh, your real sure. experience. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The thing is, like, we've, we haven't had any any complaints. No, it's there been, hasn't been, been anything. fantastic this entire time we've been. It's here. hard. Like, uh, I would yeah. be lying if I said it was easy, but I mean, it's it's. <laughs> you're working. learning to be a freaking pilot. Yeah, it's like it's like it's stressful, but it's it's like the good stress, like if that's if that exists, because we're like we have something to work towards like we're yeah. working towards like our like pilot, yeah. uh, being a pilot so yeah. it's like you working know why you're doing the, it yeah. you know why we're here then i get to be the respected captain that's the, that's the yeah thing. you can be like, the oh, guy yeah, yeah. Yeah. so what is the coolest thing the coolest thing oh, oh man for, i actually for I, each of you because i think that you have different coolest yeah, and yeah. worst things i think the coolest thing for me is probably yatik our flight mentor yeah okay that i'm gonna agree with yeah that, that one. yeah so uh, like he was saying we have a flight mentor who is uh he's a captain for a lot of airlines yeah. for se the 787 and so he helps a lot um He's not. He's affiliated with the school, but he's not like a professor. So he purely is just he helping just us get through the program. So he, um, like he was saying, like this past weekend, uh, we flew in a 1940 yeah, to Havilland to Havilland Chipmunk, Chipmunk, which is like yeah. a old old plane, and he just flies us because he wants to exp like yeah, expose his, us. His like idea is to expose us to as much about aviation as possible, whether it be old, yeah. new. And so he just wants us because he was talking about a, a good pilot back in the, like the golden era of pilots was like in the night after the 1940s. So after World War II, you had all the fighter pilots that became mm -hmm. commercial pilots, but they were, they understood everything about aviation because they were flipping around and doing things. And so then when they came commercial pilots, they were able to handle like stressful situations yeah. or things. So he tries to like, you know, we'll, we did acrobatics with we him. Do. And we the do plane. like the, the loops in the plane yeah. and in the and like so, stalls. Cause, and yeah. Cause his thing was, in, in, not that we ever should be in that scenario yeah. that the plane is upside down, but if it was, you'll train us. But He's making us yeah, more comfortable. Yeah. We'll be so pilots. greetings to Mr. Yatsik. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> if he's watching, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, no, he's it's really cool because like, again, it's nice to see all the theory classes because uh, obviously we spend a lot of time on the computer now because of COVID, um, learning about like how an aircraft works. But it's hard to know how it works unless you're actually seeing it in person yeah. and understanding it. It's so, like general knowledge about the aircraft. Like we unloaded an engine, which is kind yeah. of funny. Yeah, and we, so we then we he was pointing out, out like this is like the, the carburetor, carburetor and yeah. stuff like that. So he he helps out a lot with. Um, I guess connecting the dots almost. Yeah. So I say he's probably the coolest yeah. part. And I, I'd agree. I feel like, uh, yeah. Yeah. He's it's a really awesome guy. Because it's just everything comes together with him. Yeah, it's nice. It's yeah. nice. Yeah. He helps out a lot. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, he will be pleased to hear that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we have actually another question from, yeah. from the guy who I think was just a little bit late for the starting. He said, uh, why have you chosen this country? So we're going to answer that way. It's going to be available on the YouTube <laughs> yeah. and in the full version. But you just chosen just, you know, a quick yeah, uh, yeah, repeat yeah. because yeah. you just found that on the Internet and you wanted, wanted to become to pilots. Like, yeah. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> yeah. Back in the United States of America, yeah. they just Googled and Lazarsk University came yeah. up and they're like, good this is Let's the go. country we've been yeah. dreaming about for yeah. the oh yeah our yeah, whole yeah, yeah. life in the united yeah. states of That's america yeah. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Give or take. here they are <laughs> yeah. um okay another question from the student did you ever experience culture shock after moving or was the transition smooth because you have different culture yeah. oh for we sure all yeah, have, yeah for sure right? um what was the the most you know outrageous thing that you were like i would what? say i mean there was definitely culture shock but there was nothing that was like like whoa, it was bad. like one thing, and it's yeah. it's so silly. But uh, like in our apartment in the United States, there's no zero floor. Meaning, like when you're in an apartment, yeah. which is yeah. funny because it doesn't even like it's, it's just stupid because it's an elevator. Yeah. But there's no, it's like the first floor is the first floor. There's yeah. no like there's no zero floor. There's no zero floor. Yeah. So that was kind of funny because that, that, that was, was yeah that was just like culture shock. That was just us being like what <laughs> we're just we're just stupid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can uh, share the yeah. struggle. Actually. I can share, share yeah. the struggle too because it's yeah. the same. Oh yeah, okay, really? Yeah. So then yeah. you know what we're talking about. Then yeah, you know what we're talking about. Yeah. I still I still make the mistakes all the time where I'm like yeah I'm like is it two three one I'm like I don't I don't you're a pilot but you can really yeah yeah. Or even that was like when we were trying to unlock the door and we couldn't unlock the door and it was oh, like yeah. there was like three of us standing around one who is a pilot two of us who are or training to be yeah. pilots we couldn't open the door and you're like you would think the three of us two who were training to be pilots and, yeah. the, and the pilot would be able to open the door but we, yeah. yeah we couldn't what open was it. the problem or were you just uh, the uh the like lock wouldn't work yeah like, we had to pull the door and then try to open it it was hard to open that so we were just kind of now we know now when we open the door yeah, it's like God, a, no one was watching so like it wasn't like it was <laughs> security like, camera was probably <laughs> yeah, yeah. the security guy was laughing at us yeah but no as far as that culture shock I'm trying to, there's no, really nothing besides, no. besides like language barrier but i mean, I mean was, there's an obvious language like barrier that's, but that's kind of to be expected and then do you have any problems related to the thing that you don't speak any polish 
I mean, there's. No, uh, we I, wish we spoke Polish. I, I'm, I'm uh, yeah, to, to, to clarify, we don't speak Polish. Like, yeah. we're not fluent yeah. Polish whatsoever. Yeah. Can you say Man, something? Anyway. Przepraszam, nie mówię po polsku. Super. Well, yeah. Doc, doc, yeah. I'm sorry, okay. I don't speak Polish. If yeah, you're yeah, not yeah. Polish, that's what that means. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but we've, especially here in Warsaw, I've never had any issues. No, and everyone, for the most part, speaks English, and yeah. they're super helpful. Yeah. And so, like, no, like, even going to, like, the grocery store, like, yeah. you can kind of make out, like, what, yeah. okay, like, do you want a bag? Yeah, like, no, I don't want a bag. Um, so stuff like that. It's not, like, it's like yeah, it's yeah. not, like, life or death where yeah. it's, like, oh, I have yeah. to know Polish. Um, but yeah. Okay. I would say this, the transition was really smooth. smooth yeah. It's yeah. Nice. Uh, coming to the culture stuff, mm -hmm. I have a question. That okay. was my question, and that is question number eight. That, that is just for you. <laughs> okay. Is it true? Very important question I am thinking about. Is it true that pilots are not allowed to drink and smoke because of the health condition? Yes, yes and no. Again, Whatever it means, wow, that was, that <laughs> yes and no. No, okay. Yes, but it no. comes back to like air law, like the man, possi man possibilities and limitations. So like you can't. Generically, no. Well, generically, generically no. no. Health wise, for like long term health things. Because yeah. obviously, for the rest of our lives, so long as we're as so long as we are still flying. We'll but like, okay, come on. Check. We're like, we're trying to be pilots. Like, you gotta like loosen up a little bit. You gotta like. Little and I think that that is on. that is the <laughs> advantage, <laughs> yeah. advantage of the culture shock because you are nineteen. Oh, oh, that's a huge bonus of being here. Yeah, I'm eighteen. And eighteen. So in the United States, obviously, you have to be twenty-one to drink. Yeah. So I'm in heaven here because I can go. To, <laughs> I can go to the store and just buy a beer, and it's it makes me really happy. I know it's, it's silly, but it makes me really happy. <laughs> like, I'm not an alcoholic, like, I promise. <laughs> um, but is does it really make the difference? Can I, you really? I would say no. I, I, I mean, I would say you're allowed to drink. I I mean, obviously, like you can't like smoke every day. Yeah, you can't drink like, every like, day. There's regulations that when, while you're flying, you can't have. It's kind of like driving a car. Yeah. There's like a, a level. Or you, like you can't drink. I think it's yeah. like 24 hours before a flight. But for the, instance. And the level is way lower than it is for like drinking and driving. Oh, like the because like it has alcohol to be, level, it has to be yeah. like trace amount, very very small because of the fact you're flying 100. But like yeah, like I had people. a beer this weekend and it was like I'm not like trying to get drunk. Like it's just a beer, like a casual beer. But it doesn't. What but we didn't. But we didn't fly afterwards. So this is what we'll smoking. Clarify I, that. I don't we smoke. didn't fly yeah. after we. Yeah, Personally, yeah. I don't smoke, and yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I feel yeah. like yeah. it's probably not a good idea to smoke if you want to become a pilot. Yeah. Because in the long term, I guess. Yeah, because yeah. uh, for the medical it. check, we had to. They checked our oxygen level. Yeah. Like we had to. It was kind of funny. It's like a tube, and you like you blow into the tube, and it's check your oxygen. It's, it's, yeah. There's like a computer, and so it has like a little little chart, and it's like the average person. So it has this little line that goes up. So it was funny because I was trying to like blow as much as I could because I wanted to be like above the line. So I'd be like, yeah, like yes. Yeah. My lungs are better. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. I would say you could drink more than you can smoke. I would yeah. say smoking, because cool. we even yeah, Guys, that's an we made that, we made that question way more complex than it should have been. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Another question from the student. Studio. Okay. You know, which is your favorite model of plane you would love to fly one day? Ooh. That's that's a nice that's one. That's an exciting yes. one. I'm really exciting. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> that might hey. The the was it the competition question? The I knew it. Might be it. That might be the one. Mm -hmm. um, oh, uh, uh, we have a Shimon who's in our class. He's crazy about the dash eight. And I don't dash know. Eight. He might be watching. Yeah. So hey, Shimon, yeah, I don't know if you're here. <laughs> but it, it, dash eight. It's funny. Every yeah. time we see a dash eight, he goes nuts. But personally, ooh, um, I go Boeing Stearman. Like it's a. It was a 1940s uh, biplane trainer airplane that mm -hmm. it was for U.S. airmen. Mm -hmm. But this, the, I, I don't know. I'm a huge fan of like Indiana Jones slash like adventure stuff. So like yeah. any biplanes, I love biplanes. Yeah. And the Boeing Stearman, I don't know. Yeah, I think that's that's my. I think I like the the Cirrus yeah. SR22, which is I don't know how to explain it. It's super expensive. Super probably never be advanced, able to afford yeah. to buy it. But I'm gonna use the Google app. Uh, <laughs> after yeah, we finish yeah, this. Yeah. It's, it's, Need to write it's, this down and yeah. check it out. You can see the difference between he's got the sleek SR22. Oh, sleek! You got the closed, like glass and I'm over here like with the little leather hat on. <laughs> the scarf. <laughs> yeah. But what would you choose to fly? Um, again, I don't understand anything yeah, that i'm yeah, gonna yeah. say right now yeah, yeah, yeah. so it might be yeah. stupid okay. most probably it's gonna be <laughs> it's stupid okay, okay. what would you choose and is there any yeah. difference between flying a little plane from yeah. warsaw to yeah. krakow mm -hmm. or a huge <laughs> plan flying, yeah. where you have um bats yeah, yeah. pool you yeah. can you have a pool yeah. in the plane i mean you could you, massive yeah. balance wise it would probably be really in a bad. restaurant but yeah. technically i guess you could yeah, why not okay. why not yeah why not plane. you know party plane. yeah with cool. two floors like a, a new model of the plane you just gave an idea can you can you i mean 
Is it an elevator in the plane? Or? Uh, I, a I had the pleasure of flying on an A380. So I didn't get to fly it. He did. <laughs> so it's an Airbus A380, which is what you're talking about. It's like the double Thank decker. Thank you for letting me know. Yeah, and it basically it's, it's kind of cool. It's like a little staircase, and you kind of go up the staircase. And it, it's, it was cool because, anyway, they, they just made the last one, um, unfortunately. Yeah. Anyone who's like an aviation geek, like they just made the they last just, one. They just, the Long story short, because of all the COVID stuff, long haul flights are becoming less and less common yeah. because people aren't wanting to fly. That's so the huge we can talk about, jumbo yeah. jets, the A380s, the 747s, those are slowly getting like cycled out. They're just getting rid of them. Um, yes. <laughs> do you need to check and to make a uh, plane work constantly? Yes. And yes. If, if it doesn't, you know, if it just stays yeah. without the business for yeah. a long time, it's just... There's, yeah. there's, there's been daily maintenance of, checks and... Yeah. And especially a lot of airlines now, it's been a big issue because of the fact that uh, some of the aircraft have been sent away because there's not, there's no demand. No one's right. flying. I know that was huge in the United States, especially like even domestic travel. Yeah. There was all these airlines that were like, we have, you know, I'm just gonna make something up, 30 airplanes, and we're only using like three or four. Yeah. Okay. And so it was like those four planes were just sitting there, but then that becomes a maintenance issue because yeah, because yeah. they were just sitting cold. And yeah. So can you just answer my? The oh yeah, yes, of course. Sorry, sorry. The question: so Is there any difference it. between flying a huge? <sighs> Some the there house is, or, or just a little it's, it's, plane? It's difficult because, like, there is a difference. There's an obvious size difference. But as far as, like, the technicalities of actually flying, I would say they're fairly similar. I mean, there's more complex systems with, like, let's say, like, the A380 compared to, like, a like yeah, a A320. Yeah. Um, or even, because uh, I'm thinking, like, almost jump between, like, Cessna to A380. Like, a small airplane is going to have very, like, basic rudimentary systems right. to fly place to place. But then you have, like, the A380, which is going to have... Right. Thousands of and then there's obviously systems. differences between like Boeing and Airbus. They have yeah. different systems. Like Airbus is like a side stick, where Boeing yeah. is like a an actual yoke. Yeah. Um, but I'd, I'd, they all. I mean, airplane's an airplane. Like they all. I mean, yes, of course, there's differences. But as far I'd, as like, but for you, I mean, what would be more? Do you think that there is more joy in, in one of the? I would say that there's probably be more joy in flying something that's smaller, just because it's yeah. It's, you, you get to you, do, it's, you, it's like you do you. Like you can just fly where you want to yeah. go, that kind of thing. Whereas if you're flying the big stuff, it's fun in terms of your – because it's obviously very satisfying to fly something. And you get paid that, for it. And, yeah. <laughs> well, obviously, that would be your job. <laughs> yeah. But I think I think more – I guess more satisfaction would be something smaller, I would say. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Can Thanks you ask a question yeah. about the model? Can you ask this one? Because I think it's kind of interesting. We didn't ask but, that. But yeah. this relates to the, the topic. Where oh, okay, yes, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I Sorry. don't understand what is related <laughs> to the topic <laughs> or not. So thank you for telling me this. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, there is a question about the model of the okay, plane. Yeah, as far yeah, as yeah. I understand, is like V tall? V tall? V tall, yeah. V tall. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is it yeah. cool or not? Like a V tall like warship? No, 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 <laughs> no, not warship. No, what no, are you war thinking of? Yeah, I'm thinking like okay, Call okay, of Duty, okay, like the VTOL. <laughs> okay, yeah, uh, the VTOL, uh, it's basically like a helicopter that can become an airplane. Ah. So like, it's the, it's the, okay, so Transformer? Like, uh, imagine like, imagine like an airplane body, right? It's like the, like a okay. long tube. And then you have like on the sides, in front of make like arms. Uh, it's these two little like, down. basically yeah. like propellers. Can Studio make a screenshot of that please? <laughs> <laughs> but then, and then, but when it goes, it, so it takes off like vertically like a helicopter and as it, gets higher and higher it can start rotating those like blades forward and it becomes a uh, an airplane how does that work with like licensing you I, get a no, I have no idea See, we don't even know is it cool the question was if it's cool or not oh, no, oh it's definitely, it's definitely cool. cool no it's definitely really cool i don't know cool. how it and works I think but it's definitely the cool the systems for that must be like now again respect to those pilots cuz like yeah. <laughs> that's that's crazy because you have the, the there's differences between flying a helicopter and then flying an airplane and so helicopter mechanics are completely different in terms of how they work like and now you're and in, in a VTOL you're flying both that's so what I'm saying. I don't yeah, need both. You'd have, to, you'd, have have to, don't you'd have to understand the principles of both, and that's that's beyond that's beyond us. <laughs> that's, that's, I don't think I'm going to fly VTOL. <laughs> yeah. okay. It's kind of complicated. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, question that we have now is, 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 since the day you applied for your degree, have you become even more interested in visiting aviation museums? Yes, actually. Well, we were already huge aviation <laughs> fans yeah. before coming here, but yes. I mean, yeah. just because... No, and now we're like little kids when we see an airplane because oh, yeah. you're like, oh, look, airplane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, we're that guy. Yeah. We're like, yeah. oh, look, airplane. Like, like we, we, went to, we went to Warsaw Chopin Airport to go plane go, spotting. Go plane spotting. Yeah. Now you have coming. two toys, planes, right yeah. there in your pockets from Lazarsky oh. University Marketing oh. Department. Oh, my goodness. Yes, See, that, that's do. news to us. Oh, my God. Yeah. Okay. 
Make you know, this yeah, worth I, it. I, we, when we were small kids, we our parents took us to uh, like just aviation museums in general, and so it was always interesting, especially as a little kid. Airplanes are always cool because it's oh just yeah, for sure, it's cool to see. But I think especially now that we understand more and more about how those planes fly, that you're like, oh, now it's really now it's really f- sophisticated. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. I would yeah. say definitely it's piqued our interest even more, especially oh, now that we're actually learning about it yeah. rather than just being like a observer. Because then you're looking, and you're like, can I fly it? Like, <laughs> could <laughs> yeah, I fly yeah, it? The yeah. logistics, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. What? A, what? What? Yeah. Oh, we have a question. Very interesting question. <laughs> Can you read that? Okay. Since this is a question from student, what do you think about Polish girls? Interesting question. Interesting. Well, do you, I'll, I guess I can take the bullet. Yeah. I would say, compared to the, I don't want to offend anyone in the U.S. If you're watching <laughs> oh, the U.S., no. but comparatively to the U.S., I would say more attractive. Yeah. So beautiful nation. Beautiful, Le- beautiful nation. Beautiful nation. Beautiful nation. Everyone's beautiful. Thank you. Everyone's that beautiful. was a perfect there's answer. There's, 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 Thank, yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We can finish the episode. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, another question. I would like to switch to this one because it's okay. Really, like, but we, and wow. we have this one and this one. Jesus, we have so many questions. So we have three of them. Yeah. Choose whatever you like. Yeah, but I would like to start with okay. this one. Uh, there are for sure risks uh, of flying. Oh, for sure. Yeah. General, of course. Do you have a story <laughs> you came across that stands out for you? This lo- you're like, wow. So it's not ne- it's not necessarily like a story that we've lived through, but no, no, like no, no. in general. I mean, I think it would which is e- an example for you. Let's yeah. say. I would say the, the easiest example would obviously be Captain Sully landing on the Hudson would be oh, yeah. a, an emergency situation. But I actually think at once a little bit. I think Can I just stop you for yeah, a second? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. oh. Now we're even more little kids. Now yes. we're going to be like in our like apartment. Like, you know, yeah. like <laughs> and you have yeah, like two of them. Yeah, yeah, so you're going to have competitions. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I just, yeah. I just wanted, them. you know, yeah. to hand it no, we, to we you. Can, yeah, we can have like a little string. That's so awesome. You know, so it looks like it's flying. Oh my goodness. That's. Even See, we're children. We're basically children. That's so cool. Yeah. What does um, it have? It has Lazarski on it. Yeah. Like, that's so cool. Well, <laughs> we're little kids. Is that's so awesome. What we're getting at. <laughs> Surprisingly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> now, you have, now yeah. you have two of them. Does it look uh, the same uh, to the... Does it look similar to the plane that you have the trainings on? Yeah, well... It's a little bigger than the, well, I mean, not that. <laughs> <laughs> this is like I have to allow me to get in, you know. Yeah, yeah. no, 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 but uh, this would be more like a seven forty seven. I would we're say not, we're yeah. not there yet. Yet, yeah, you know, we'll get there eventually. Yeah. But so no. th- this is the goal. This is the goal. This is the goal. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, I just oh, yeah. interrupted you when yes. you were talking sorry. about no, some no. serious so stuff. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. curious moment of this episode. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. Yeah. I, I, I like this. Again, so like, coming like back to this example story. Yes. No, I think the craziest story was it's called the Gimli Glider, and I think was a I think was a an Air Canada flight. Um, anyway, it was over the Atlantic Ocean, and all the engines uh, completely cut out. They burned out. Uh, what happened was there was a like a fuel imbalance. They didn't put enough fuel, and the pilots the pilots were did everything correctly. Yeah. The ground crew didn't put enough fuel, so the flight the engines just just burned out. So they had to glide for like over an hour all the way down to a runway that was never designed to have that big of an airplane, but everyone made it. Like, everyone survived. Yeah. I think this, this ties back also to, like, aviation is, like, super safe. Like, to yeah. your question. There's, there's always... Yeah. It's, there's it's always, super yeah. safe, honestly. Like, yeah. I mean, of course, there's... Y- you'll hear about, like, the big incidents, and obviously there's there's crashes every now and then. And, like, uh, like our mentor, like, he was saying, like, um, in one of his planes, like, the engine cuts out. And he's like, ah, oh, it just cuts out. Like, the whole engine cuts yeah. out, and he was but so the, casual idea, about it. Yeah, but the idea behind aviation is, like, to make it as safe as possible. So it, it's really also safe, Also to train honestly. us as pilots to make sure that if there is a, an emergency situation, not, we're fine. Like, it's like, okay, we'll just do what we right. have to do. Because yeah, like it's like aviate, navigate, communicate. It's like the biggest thing. Fly the plane first. I remember that. Yeah, like yeah. Sure, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like the first yeah. thing they teach you. Is just I would to go to the flight where you are the pilots. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Because yeah. you're saying, <laughs> you know, with, with, with yeah. s- about the things that are very complicated and scare yeah. for a lot of people. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. with just, it's really know, not that scary. Thing, I think a lot of people are afraid of aviation just because even like commercial planes because it, it right. is scary because it's like it's yeah, weird. It's the idea of flying in a small metal tube, you know, <laughs> at 30,000 feet in the air is, <laughs> <Well>. yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, it's really, it's a really weird idea, but it's, but when you understand that like all those people that are, are they're trained to keep you safe. And now that we know how much work it takes to become a pilot. Yeah, we're like, now I feel now extra safe. Now we feel now extra like, safe. That guy, trust me, like, that guy has gone through That guy line. knows what he's <laughs> that doing. That guy knows yeah. what he's I respect to the captain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can I have a quick question? Just a yeah. quick question. Oh, yeah. How many years it takes to become a pilot? Ooh, it depends. Yeah. Cool. So that's, a, that's actually a good topic. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> Thank <Yes>. you. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I know. I'm sorry. It, yeah, that actually is a good topic for the university. Uh, so our program is an integrated program, which basically means 
it's, go from one license to the next. It's super no accelerated. So I guess delay. I can, if anyone's interested. So we get our private license like this summer is what we're aiming for, which is PPL, and then we'll get uh, we'll get like IFR rated, which is instrument uh, uh, flight yeah. rules, yeah. and then like night rated, and then we'll get like multi-engine rated, and then commercially rated for like yeah. jet airplanes. Yeah. Um, so it'll take us, I guess, three years, right? Three years. Three but years to three go years from zero to ATPL. Well, that's yeah. not a lot. It's not a lot. No. But, however, and that's a big selling point for the university and one of the reasons yeah, why we chose it. Um, if you do it on your own, it can take upwards to like five to six years. Um, if you're doing it, it on, your, it's own on time. your own time. Meaning it's not built yeah. in. And which is also nice but with uh, like our program, though, is because the like the flight classes are built in next to the law classes. Right. So it's like we're doing them both in the same day. Again, so like, two birds with one stone. Yeah, yeah, so then it's like we're getting those hours every single day. And so then it just builds up. Yeah, and like so we're, we were talking about, yeah, up. we will be at the airport like every single day flying, which yeah. – if you're nor doing it on your own, you'll do it maybe once or twice a week. Maybe so you can see where yeah. it'll it'll be super, super yeah. quick, so which is exciting for us. It's stressful. I would say it's more stressful than doing it on your own because, because it's just one to the next. It's one, but it's boom, having boom, said boom. that, you're also going one to the next. So you're getting the yeah. next to the next. So like I'll thing. be yeah. a first officer, hopefully, uh, at 21, which is like mind-blowing yeah. to think that like yeah. my friends will still be in like university <laughs> when I'm like a first yeah. officer. Yeah. Yes, hopefully. Think, yeah. If everything goes, yeah. yeah. The whole university yeah. is yeah. sitting like this now. It's been, it's been, it's been good so far, but yeah. yeah. Okay, uh, shall we go to, an, um, can I ask you just one question? Yeah. That yeah, is yeah. Very, do you have a final exam, like the defense of your thesis we have on management and economic faculties, yeah. or it's a little bit different? We have, I don't think we have necessarily like a thesis at the end. I think our we, form of exam are the 14 tests this, this they spoke ATPL of, okay. Tests, okay. which are so, but for with our, our license. With, we yeah. may for our law classes. We're not uh, that I'm not entirely sure on yet. We do have finals. Like we, every every semester, we have normal finals. Yeah, we pass. So like a bit of big <laughs> final at the very end. I'm not really for sure if we have to do a thesis or not. Well, you're but a first year student, so good luck with yeah. getting getting yeah. to know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. Can you help me with uh, this this question? Yeah, I think they're the same. This one and this one. Yeah, I think so. I'll just read the second one, okay? Uh, do you have something like a dream place you would like to fly to? Ooh. Fly I think Australia that place. For me. City, maybe. I've always wanted to go to Australia. Crikey. Crikey, yeah. <laughs> With a lot of spiders. <laughs> lot just of, walking yeah, around yeah, your buddy. Ooh, yeah, snakes. Spiders, saying snakes, hi. Great white sharks. But like, I, I want to see like a, like a hold of koala. You know how nice that would be like to hold oh, a koala? See, that's the, that's the Instagram coming in. It's the Instagram like picture. One of our professors, like Mateusz. Oh yeah, he has yeah, a picture yeah, yeah. of a koala, and yeah, I was so true. jealous because he he had a koala, and I was like, I want to do that. Yeah. So basically, what? Just are you, are you just making fun of me for like the koala? Yeah. Oh yeah, you're just so cute with yeah. the showing this showing this koala. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's the imaginary can koala. Can Photoshop like, that yeah. for yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. For yeah now. Someone please Photoshop a koala so I can yeah. feel like I went to Australia. <laughs> yeah. I think Australia for me. Okay, though. Australia. Yeah. What about you? Yeah, I don't know. I've Tokyo Narita. I like to fly to Tokyo Narita at least once. I like. I like Tokyo. there. I've been there, but I want to fly there. Oh, you want to fly there? Wait, okay. Is this question like we want to fly there? Yes. Like f we're the ones flying. Australia. Yeah, yeah. I'd say Tokyo Narita. I'd like to go. I like, I like Tokyo. I want to fly. Yeah. Okay. Tokyo, okay. okay. Uh, it's okay. not as cool as the koala. I mean, <laughs> I had a whole story with yeah, like the koala. Like koala yeah. Story yeah. And, yeah. Ted. I don't we're, know. We're <laughs> promising we're going to Photoshop that. Yes, <laughs> and please. That will be the cover photo for the yeah, yeah, the cover photo. Yes, exactly. Just, yeah. Okay. 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 We did that. Now we have nice comment. Just one nice comment. I love these guys. From marketing department, uh, Magda Michkovska. Magda Michkovska. Greetings she to loves her. You. Oh, cheers. <laughs> Thank you. And I, I think a lot of people have the same feeling about <laughs> you guys today. Because literally, uh, we, we honestly have three minutes left. But I oh. asked our wonderful guys that on that side and we have 10 minutes more because i don't want to let you go Ooh, and i, I well, we just you. we because we have okay. we have okay. questions <laughs> and it's really interesting i mean everything yeah, that yeah. you say today uh will you read that please is it hard to operate your steering shaft or yo jesus so Ooh. many uh new words uh sorry don't know the term midair how often do you need to help from the second pilot okay uh, okay uh I was actually really surprised when I um, when we started flying. Uh, it's like it's crazy sensitive, yeah, but it doesn't take sensitive. a lot to do something. So like you yeah. could just like barely pull back on the stick, and, and you're gonna be going it. up. Yeah. So like I would say it's easy to actually control. Yeah. It's really not a difficult. lot of a lot of times too. It's it's nice because even though the stick is or the yoke is super sensitive, yeah. you can you can feel it just like in your body oh, yeah. if you're moving up or down. So you can almost have like an internal like. I don't know, you can internally keep yourself moving straight. Yeah. Because, like, when we, when we flew last weekend, you just, we were hitting a little bit of, like, turbulent stuff. But every yeah. time I would adjust, you could feel that the plane would drop or move up. So it's, like, but they're, they're sensitive. And, but, and, and the other question about being the second, the second pilot, a lot of it is just monitoring. Mostly it's, like, if the other guy's yeah. flying, 
you're just all you're doing is making sure that like he like yeah it's like he asked just like are the ignition switches on is the are, like engine rpm is it okay is yeah. the oil good i mean you're just you're basically verifying what he's seeing and you're just telling and him, they do yes, that, that even at that. the commercial level yeah uh, like we've it's had like experience with like yeah. simulators here um which the school has simulators by the way yeah. really <laughs> awesome like an a320 and whatever yeah that's another yeah. discussion yeah. but um <laughs> yeah. but yeah no it's a lot of i wouldn't say they're actually taking control it's just a lot of cross-checking yeah. to make sure we're done also to see. call outs because like especially if a pilot's landing there's a lot that's going on so the pilot's trying to focus on landing so the right. other guy will be making like altitude call out saying you have 500 feet to the ground yeah. or it'll be airspeed like watch your airspeed or like even airspeed. like like talking to the like air traffic control like usually the pilot yeah. who's not flying is communicating, communicating. so the pilot can focus, on, focus flying. on flying yeah so yeah yeah Mm. I hope that answered your question. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had a question and I honestly okay, he's gonna come back. Uh we have we have this question. Can you read it and I, I'm gonna fo- focus on my thoughts? Okay, <laughs> sure, sure. I, I'm like just your second pilot, okay? <laughs> second <laughs> pilot, yes. Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He actually yeah. did, it yeah. worked. So I got oh, it. she cross checked, it's you good. Can, yeah, it's good. You can read it now. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay, <laughs> so I think it's like a technical yeah. question. How many hours of flying uh, have you clocked? At the moment, none that we can necessarily... We like, can't log any. We can't log it. However, we we've flown, I'd say, probably... 40 minutes? 40, 40 minutes? to f- 40 to 45. Um, and the reason but we, like, we can't yeah. clock it because yeah. we're not like the pilot. We're yeah, technically we're not, the not the pilot in command. command. Yeah, um, so they call it like... Th- technically, it's called the PIC, and it's the pilot in command. We weren't the pilot in command. We just flew for a small yeah. segment. And so we don't get to necessarily log that. Yeah. Um, but w- once we start flying, then we, we start practical yeah. training. Hopefully, the next month in April. Yeah. Uh, we just have been waiting for the weather yeah. to get better. Plus, weather and theory. We, and theory, we have to finish yeah. our theory before we're allowed to like Which get in the airplane. So. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Safer. Okay. Yeah. And I think uh, the question that we just got is a little bit related to mine because I remember uh, during one of the walks with Lazarski Student mm-hmm. Help Desk, uh, you've told me about this simulator. Wait, wait, yes. Yeah. <laughs> something yes. that yes. you understand what I'm yes. talking yes. about and you're going <laughs> to tell yeah. us yeah. more about that. And uh, just, you know, to combine yeah. these okay. questions, the student is asking, is Lazarsk University a place to learn how to fly a plane and stuff? So probably, I think so, that a student yes. is asking, so do you really have the real equipment, the real trainings yes. and the yes. real civil yeah. that's that's kind of a, stuff? That's a huge, uh, yes. Yes. Short and answer, uh, yes. We're part, we should have mentioned that from the very beginning. Yeah. The university has partnered with Goldwing's uh, Flight Academy, which is a flight school here in Warsaw Mm -hmm. and so they they go like they coincide like together so like our actual flight training is through gold wings however we have like how would you like our like university classes are technically professors are flight instructors right so like so it's not necessarily like we have our law professors that are just law professors but then some of the like aviation professors are flight instructors and they're just telling us right uh from gold wings they're just telling us what to like for like uh which is really cool because yeah. like the planes we we fly, yeah. it's like the gold wings, but they have like the, the Lazarski logo. like yeah. almost exactly like, like this. That. Yeah, I don't like know if you can it, see it that. Really looks but like it literally that. is like yeah. that. Um, and then yeah, we have uh, an A320 simulator, um, but full, full, it's, like it's, it's been commercially certified. rated. Yeah. So like you can log hours with it. Like yeah. it's the real deal. Yeah. And we've flown it once. We've flown it once. It's scary. With, with the, yeah. And it was funny because there was another guy that was flying with us who knew what he was doing. Um, <laughs> we He's did a, not yeah. know what we were doing. And so obviously because we've we've just done the theory behind almost like small airplane. So to jump into a real Airbus A320 <laughs> yeah. cockpit and to try to pretend that you know what you're doing. Yeah. And so he was like, things would be like flashing and it would be like uh, like warnings. And he's like, don't worry about that. And you're like, no, no I'm worrying about when it. When it's like, like screaming like, at you. I'm yeah. like, I, I think this is terrifying. Yeah. Yeah. But and I actually think that we have, you know, on the website in YouTube, we have this uh, kind of videos oh, that, yes. that, yes. that yes. shows yeah. what yeah. exactly yeah. we and have. And we have. also it's have, we also have yeah. a, like a personal use simulator yeah. that yeah. is uh, obviously a much smaller scale, but it's... Um, it's used for like smaller like airplanes right. to train us on, to practice with small So what we were trying to say here is that you just you don't just read books you go to the real yeah. stuff oh, and we definitely have practical yeah. yeah we definitely have and that and that's ties back into like Yatsik the flight mentor Yatsik. he's all about he's basically saying that we need to have hands on as well as th- he's the bridge the theoretical between yeah yeah, yeah. Mm. but yes yes we planes yes <laughs> okay we have one more question that is what are your favorite type of plane I guess you already were sure that, that are different things probably yeah. it might be different things yeah. but I, I you already a different airplane but I mean I, know much I think you, you, you <laughs> okay. named the models, right? Yeah. And yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 so it's going to be on the YouTube yeah. on, in the full version. Guys already answered that. What is your favorite? T- oh, Jesus, I've just read it. Sorry. <laughs> How do you think? What is the best hub? I have no idea what I've just oh, said. Oh, hub. As in like. Uh, as I think I think they're talking about an airport. Uh, ooh. I would say hub is like uh, air- say airport. airport yeah. yeah. Best. Uh, 
Because it, it's all like relative. Like, yeah, what do you think's the best? Meaning, like, there's no best. Mm-hmm. Uh, I would say probably my favorite is probably Tokyo Narita. I really enjoyed yeah. it. And I think that might have just been because we went to Tokyo. And I was like, ah, yeah. oh, Tokyo. But I, I really enjoyed the airport in Tokyo. I just like Amsterdam. I think it's Schiphol. Just because oh, it's, we it's go there so often, it's, it's it just is fun to say Schiphol, Schiphol. <laughs> yeah, so and I, that's I, like, I like it. when we fly yeah. from uh, we're from Texas, Houston. Uh, wait, wait, by the way, wait, wait, cowboy, wait yeah, plug Texas. Well, no, I'm just saying <laughs> when we fly from Houston to like Warsaw, we have to stop in Schiphol or Schiphol, Schiphol, Schiphol. I think so. <laughs> I'm probably butchering that pronunciation. If anyone's Dutch, I am so sorry. Yeah, so <laughs> we're in Amsterdam a lot just from hopping, yeah. but. And they have the cool announcement where they're like, thank you it's for so that. It's so big, though. Yeah. It's a big yeah. airport. No, it's a really big airport. You have to, like, run to the other side. Go, yeah. when, we, when we fly, we have to go from, like, the domestic side of, like, domestic within Europe to the international side. Well, it's on the opposite side of the airport. And usually, so you're, like, like sprinting are, to yeah, the other so side. Yeah, sprinting. And it's really, yeah, it's, it's crazy. Like, we know, like, now... Because we've done it, there's like a, there's a restaurant. <laughs> yeah. there's, there's one restaurant. Yeah. We're like, okay, we're at the restaurant now. Like, <laughs> yeah. it's like we, it's we like the mile like, marker. You're yeah, like, yeah, okay. we're like, oh, okay, now yeah, we yeah. got worked good. Yeah, yeah. But I'd say Amsterdam. I like Amsterdam. That's yeah, kind of cool. Okay, thank you. What are uh, other questions that we have? Uh, we actually have. Actually, let's move. To, we don't have much time. Yeah, um, let's I move to this one and then d- d- to the, the last one, the and last then we're one. gonna just yeah. okay. Okay. jump yeah, yeah, yeah. back. <laughs> Well, we can go from the 14th. You can read. <laughs> okay. Uh, leaving aside all the studying stuff, yeah. uh, what are your hobbies? Hobbies. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> go ahead. I know that you have a YouTube channel. I do have a YouTube right. channel. I would like Slight to ask our moderator to put a link uh, in plug. Instagram and uh, in Microsoft Teams so people can open <laughs> he that. He makes fun of me for my YouTube. Follow. But don't do He's that. Yeah, I've watched your I'm videos. I'm like that. I think that's the business okay. of the brother. You know, every yeah, single brother yeah. to make fun He's from. The plug. It's, it's kind of. It's. I mean, what is the channel about? What well, do you I do just, okay. So my I did it for like almost. I would shouldn't say just for me, but like I want to like document my experience of living in Poland because that that's kind of cool. And I can that look, is cool. I can look back on it. So like I started from literally. I have if you go to my YouTube, my very first video is me literally flying from Houston to Warsaw. Like I've videoed myself packing and stuff like that. So like I, the whole goal is to just film like what I'm doing here. And also my friends in the United States, like it's hard to like tell someone about it. So why not show them in a video form? And uh, we want to, he wants to create a channel and we want to yeah. start doing like aviation stuff. Like we can video our flying for instance. Um, but it's honestly just, kind of, yeah, more of like a, I shouldn't say a documentary, but it's like, well, it's yeah, I'm, it's, documentary it's, and it's, it's just me and I'm like not really experienced. Like, don't judge my videos if you're going to watch them, but, um, <laughs> just like them. Yeah. Like them and subscribe. Leave a dislike. Yeah. Well, um, okay. What about your hobby then? We know that you have a, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, running, play the banjo, yeah. uh, photography. Photography, yeah. yeah. I want yeah. to mention because yeah. you're always coming with the camera yeah, to always, our I meetings. I love taking pictures, and I just recently got into like film photography. Like, anyway, I love film photography now. But yeah, but yeah, photography. I like to run. Which is uh, that, now, now I sound really boring. Now that I now that <laughs> so I you can make the videos for your YouTube exactly. Channel. I'm the I'm the gorgeous face <laughs> on on front. Like yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> you can be behind the camera. Yeah, mm-hmm. um, but yeah, no, yeah. But do you like do you like to film people or things or? Uh, Anything. I mean, it could be it could be architecture. It could be animals. Cool. People. You, and cool. you draw s- and t- stuff too. Yeah, no, I do sketch stuff. But I'm like, but yeah, you're more artsy than I am. I'm not really. Yeah. Mm. But I'm, yeah. I mean, I play guitar, and that's like. <laughs> and you play guitar. Hello. Rock on. Yeah. But then, <laughs> don't even. Yeah, don't okay, even. Yeah, so you guys. So, yeah. so you have hobbies, and it doesn't matter. Like, I oh, mean, your sure. faculty yeah. Yeah. doesn't matter. It doesn't mean that you spend. Oh, no, 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 no. And that's the thing is like, cause like even we have like, a life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. By the way, do you have time for that? I mean, do you have a lot of yeah. free time? Yeah, yeah, we have yeah, time. Because I think the studies, it's like, because yeah, I think because you just I mean, gotta allocate time. It's like a normal. Most of our stuff is almost like a normal university in terms of. I mean, mm-hmm. besides the fact that we're learning how to fly an airplane, <laughs> which is not normally a university thing. Yeah. But it's like, yeah, you're allocated like class time, and then you just you just do the work, and then you. Just we definitely have time. time. Usually yeah. during the week, it's like okay, focus on class, and on the weekend, yeah. like then I had a beer, for instance. Want, yeah. yeah. To go back to that, yeah. I had, uh, had yeah, a beer. Yeah. Um. Yeah, no, you definitely. Okay, we will be uh, finishing soon, and I just have one question that is, um, you know, it's not about your faculty, it's not about uh, the students that are that you have there. Yeah, Uh, it is about you, and uh, we know that you have a brother. Oh, ah, little brother. A little brother. A little brother. Yeah, Yeah. little Pazinski or Pieczynski. Sorry, (laughs) a little, little little guy. Yeah, Yeah. Yeah. I shouldn't say little. He's yeah, he's yeah. Why are you holding like this? (laughs) He's not. He's not short. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, little brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So is he uh, going to be a pilot too? That's that's what he wants. Yeah, Yeah, actually, yes. He's probably watching. So So hi to the little brother whose name is Langston. 
Okay. Yeah, so, so hi to you. To <laughs> and uh, can you tell me, okay, have you ever thought about family business in this area? Like starting Ooh. our own airline? I don't know, probably. Ooh. Ooh. Kaczynski Airlines? Yeah. <laughs> Kaczynski Airlines, yeah. yeah. Without why. Uh, without, without the why, make everybody I question what's I've never thought about it, but I guess we, technically, if we have three pilots, that's, that's good. Story. And a lot of money. Oh, a, lo uh, a lot of money, like oh, yeah, thousands yeah, yeah. of yeah, thousands gonna, of some, billions. We're going to have to take <laughs> some loans out, but that's, that's okay. <laughs> yeah, whatever. No, but uh, uh, in our dreams, maybe, yeah. yeah. In your <laughs> but dreams, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It, it would be crazy, because, and I'm, I'm hoping he does do the pilot thing, because then three pilots is kind of insane. We, none of our, oh, none of our that's people a, in yeah. our family are pilots. We're the first that want to yeah. be pilots. So, so it just happened. Yeah. I mean, we just liked aviation, and it was like, yeah, I'd like to be a pilot. So then, why that's not? That's cool. Fly. Yeah. So and now our little brother. So we're gonna have, I guess, yeah. three pilots in the family, which yeah. is. But well, that's really yeah. cool. That's yeah. really really cool. Yeah. We saw the difference. So then we went from no pilots to three. So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's, that's big, that's yeah, big jump, but yeah. 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 And the last last question okay. that I have to you: Does being brothers help you in your studies? I would say yes. I hate him. <laughs> whoa, whoa! That was so sweet from from two yeah, yeah, sides, yeah, yeah, honestly. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I, uh, say it. Yeah. Go ahead. No. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. I think so, especially when it comes to uh, like, classwork and things, because it's mm -hmm. obviously he may understand something that I don't, and then vice, vice versa. versa yeah. So then and we help each nice. other study, and it's yeah. it is really nice because yeah. it's like we live together. So like it's yeah. like when we do classes, he's sitting on the couch, yeah. and I'm it, sitting. It is kind of funny because well, when we're on like yeah, either Zoom meetings or MS Teams meetings, yeah. it's funny because like I'll be sitting pretty much like on the couch with the camera facing this way, yeah. his camera's facing that way. But it's weird because we could be like, do you know? <laughs> yeah, we can like because it's like yeah. we're in the same room. Yeah. But yeah, I would Guys. say it definitely helps. Yeah, I mean course. you could do it obviously without having brothers. But yeah, yeah, yeah. don't don't, if, yeah, don't yeah, yeah, you yeah. don't have to have a sibling <laughs> being it's a yeah. Nice. It's just nice. Yeah. 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 Well, I from my side, from our side, I guess I just need to tell you that you're. Cool guys. Well, thank you. Yeah, the episode was awesome. awesome. Literally yeah. one of Honestly, them. my favorite. Thank you. Thank you. I think yeah. that was yeah, literally one of my favorite because you are just cool people. Oh, well, thank, thank you. you, thank you, thank you very cool much well, for, for being. Us. Thanks for inviting us. Yeah, yeah and it was it's really awesome yeah. to talk about. Thank it. you for saying yeah. yes to us. Oh, yes, of course. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, so let's move to this yeah. beautiful moment. Yeah. The best question, the coolest one. Who will receive a present, a cool package from Lazarsky University uh, Marketing uh, Department? I think I like the one was our favorite model of airplane. Which you need you to agree? find it. And. What, do you have another? Uh, yeah, you can have two options, right? Okay. From two guests? I think so. Or if you agree. S since we have two guests. I don't know who asked it, but that, that was a good yeah, question. I'm no. going to find that. Okay, yeah. okay. okay. No, please I'll agree. do. I like yeah, my favorite model. Yeah. Yeah, 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 it's an interesting question. Yeah, okay. No, uh, yeah. Okay. It's, it's just nice. yeah, so, so this thanks, was man, from... <laughs> or a woman. Or well, you don't, we don't know who asked it, but thanks. thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we'll find that. Okay. Or we'll find no. that. No, Shout no. out to the person that won, so good job. Yeah, <laughs> audio. Or not <laughs> what do you think, audios? <laughs> uh, yeah. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, I'm going to find that. Okay. okay. Yeah, we'll yeah, 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 find yeah. that. We'll yeah. write to that person yeah. uh, on Instagram. Congrats. So that we'll person, congratulations. Yeah, congrats. congratulations. Congratulations. Uh, I think I found it. Yes, oh. I did. But uh but I think I know the person. Okay, so congratulations. You were the first to ask which is your favorite model of plane you would love to fly one day. That was it? Yes. Yeah, that was yeah, it. So congratulations. congratulations. Thank congratulations. you guys for choosing. So, sadly, we need to finish. Sadly, Aww. really. I think Aww. that was one of the coolest, coolest episodes that we had. Not because Thank we you. have two guests instead of one, oh, yes. but because... Yeah. <laughs> we should have had two hours for Yeah, that, exactly, <laughs> because we have two of you and we don't That's care that okay, you speak okay. simultaneously. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sorry, yeah, 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 yeah. sorry if we talk too fast, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, like my bad. They're going to, you know, they're going to make it slow in YouTube. They're gonna, yeah, yeah. Put the playback speed. Yeah, yeah, like just <laughs> just like, yeah. We're going to talk like, what is your favorite? We're going to talk like normal people. Guys, we really appreciate the honesty and the real reflections that you have from your faculty. I honestly thought that I'm going to cry in one second because we have such a cool faculty yeah. here at oh, it's, it's yeah, really it's awesome. awesome. And yeah. it's like, you know, it's not just about management or economics yeah. or international yeah. exactly, relations. Yeah. And we're really cool. super, super happy that we have you at the university. Why, thank you. Thank and you. wish you good cross. luck in all it's the great tests. It's great to be here, yeah. <laughs> <Fingers> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever yeah. you have. We're going to have Finals. a fly uh, with you. Oh, uh, yes. yes. We will yeah. fly yeah. you. Yes. Can you sure. tell us at the very end, we're going to finish it this yeah, way. Yeah. How do you say this? Hi, welcome on board, whatever. You know, the thing which oh, we were oh, recording. Oh, oh, oh the he like, hey, what's up, guys? That was Hi, welcome on board, your captain speaking. So can you What are they saying after the flight, like when it's over? You go for it. Huh. We haven't huh. had that portion because we're not there yet. We haven't had that portion we yet. We haven't okay. left the aircraft. You yet. just broke thanks everything. Thanks for flying with us. Thanks, thanks, thanks for flying, thanks for flying with, flying with, with us. us. Yeah.
Thanks for so flying the friendly skies. Can we just look to that yeah. camera yeah. Yes. and you're gonna say simultaneously, I know that you do that well. Okay, okay. okay. Thanks for fly <laughs> flying flying <laughs> with <laughs> Lazarski <laughs> Talks Airlines. So guys, yeah. from our side, thank you very much for being with us. We'll see you in two weeks, right? Exactly. Right? With the next guest. It's gonna be very interesting. Thank you very much, guys, for being with us. It was thank you. a Thanks very, for very us. cool, yes. cool conversation. Yeah, yeah. And so Thanks, Thanks for, for flying, flying with us. us. <laughs> <laughs>